Yo, what's going on, guys? It's Houston Sports Talk back in the video day. And today, the Los Angeles Chargers received very bad news about their second best wide receiver, Mike Williams, who's gotten enough to a great start to start the year with 20 receptions for 250 receiving yards and including a touchdown that he had in yesterday's win over the Minnesota Vikings on a 49 yard touchdown pass from. His other wide receiver duo, Keenan Allen. What a play. It was one of the top, in my opinion, one of, it was one of the top plays in yesterday's slate of the games. But Mike Williams did suffer an injury, a knee injury in yesterday's game against the Vikings and was helped off the field. And the now the Vikings um, are sorry, now the, the now the Chargers are gonna be without wide receiver Mike Williams, who has a torn ACL. I mean, it's crazy how many players have had injuries it's we it's not even the end of week three we have two games tonight and injuries have been terrible to start the year just want to notice no i'm I'm just going to name a couple notable players that are already out for the season aaron Rodgers, quarterback for the jets nick chubb running back mike williams wide receiver trevon diggs cornerback there's been other you know some other injuries concussions all over the place i just can players getting in the concussion protocol like it's just so much and then uh jalen ramsey's out for like until December there's been so many injuries to start this season I mean the Houston Texans have are, are without eight starters and not only are they without eight starter they, not only are they without eight starters but have they have like the most players on IR with like I think it's like 10 or 11 players on IR so injuries have been crazy to start this season I mean going back to even training camp when training camp started at the end of July uh, so I hope it gets better because there's a lot of notable players that are starting to, you know, get injured and out for the year, torn ACLs for, you know, Trevon Diggs and Mike Williams, you know, ending ending uh, season ending knee injury for Nick Chubb, running back from the Browns, Aaron Rodgers tore his Achilles. So I hope the injury problems in the NFL start to get better. But it's it's not even the end of the week three yet. We still have two more games, and there's so many notable players that are out for the season already. But as for the Chargers, I think they're going to have to have two wide receivers in Quentin Johnson, they, who they selected in the first round from TCU, who hasn't been great to start his NFL career. He has five receptions for, I think, 36 receiving yards. He needs to be better. Um, and I think his targets will go up with Mike Williams gone. Obviously, Keenan Allen's targets will go up. But I think the other wide receivers and tight end Gerald Everett, I th- I'm thinking guys like Joshua Palmer, uh, the running back, or the, sorry, the wide receiver, and also... Um, Quentin Johnson, um, wide receiver. Who Quentin Johnson was the third wide, rec- the third wide receiver in the depth chart. Joshua Palmer was the fourth. Now those guys slide up in the depth chart. Quentin Johnson will be number two. Joshua Palmer will be number four, or sorry, sorry, number three. And then Gerald, I would think tight end Gerald Everett would start to get some more targets as well. So it's going to take some adapting for this Chargers team without Mike Williams. This is definitely going to hurt their team without Mike Williams because he's a big target. Whether Keenan Allen is, you know, having a, an off game or, for, you know, for God forbid he's injured because Keenan Allen's missed some time here and there. So um, I think this will be, you know, a very bad injury for the Chargers. I think they're going to they're going to miss Mike Williams this season. He was getting off to a great start to the year, 250 receiving yards in three games. And he was on fire for the Chargers. That's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know your thoughts on the game. Or sorry, you guys let me know your thoughts on the game from yesterday from, from the Chargers as they won 28 to 24. Let me know your thoughts on the injury for the Los Angeles Chargers. This is a tough injury. I think they'll bounce back. I think Quentin Johnson and Joshua Palmer and Gerald Everett will stop, will, will step up for this Los Angeles Chargers team. But I still think that Mike Williams' absence will still hurt them. Use them to know your thoughts on the injury and peace out.